Hello there and welcome to the MXQ project. My name is Matthew and today's video is going to be really simple and I'm going to be showing you how to transfer gaming ROMs onto the MXQ project gaming experience LibreLec build. So the build was specifically built for LibreLec. You can check out the video, I'll leave the link in the description. Um, and it was built specifically to run retro games. Now we do have a newer version coming out, but until then you can actually try this out and it's a fantastic system to play all your old classics such as PS1, SNES, NES and so on. So what we're going to be doing in this video is transferring game ROMs. You maybe already have these on your actual PC, maybe you into get retro gaming on there or some other system and you've got them sat waiting. So all you need to do is drag and drop them basically. So a gaming ROM is not specific to any hardware. You can use a PC version, whatever. So you can go up to Cool ROMs or Emu Paradise and download them and they'll work just fine as long as it's compatible with the specific core. So a core is just the console. So you've got the PSX core, um, SNES core and Genesis core and so on and so forth. And you'll find all of those on the MXQ Retro Gaming Experience build. So. This is really going to be very straightforward. We're just going to samba into the actual build. So make sure you've got LibreLec installed, either the dual booting, or you've actually got it installed into your internal memory on your MXQ box. So that's got the S805 processor on the MXQ Pro, which has got the S905 processor. Make sure you've got all that pre-installed. And then obviously use the guide on how to install the gaming build. Obviously install that, and then you can come to this video. I want to show you just how to simply drag and drop gaming ROMs so you can actually have them there ready to go. Obviously you can use the Internet Archive ROM launcher if you want, it's a very simple process to just use that system and it just makes everything easy, especially for people people who aren't actually confident uh, or transferring stuff and so forth, it just sort of gets you started. But anyway, if you're a bit more advanced than that then this is simply going to show you how to drag and drop gaming ROMs so you can just go straight into the system and play your games. Okay, so let's move straight into the first process, which is going to be sambering it into the system and finding the correct folders to drag it and drop your gaming ROMs. So yeah, that is it. Really simple process to actually just drag and drop your files and everything should just run. Just make sure you understand how to use RetroArch. Obviously you need to go into that system to actually use these games and I'll probably do another tutorial at some point on how to actually do that. So anyway, if you do get stuck and you want a bit more, more information, there is a ton of people over in the Facebook group. You can subscribe to this channel, keep up to date with all the stuff we're doing with the MXQ and the MXQ Pro. Or you can come up to the website or the forum and join up there. So if you like this video, 
give me a like if you dislike it give me a dislike that's absolutely fine and we shall see you in another video